you guys won't believe it. However, I'm in this amazing car. Amazing! You guys can recognize this car? Tell me about it. What do you guys know about this car? What do you guys remember about this car? It's crazy, but we're gonna go talk about this amazing car right now, guys. Gotta put it in gear first. Uh. There she is, guys. An amazing machine, a legendary 1981 Mercedes 300 SD. This is the car that I took across the country a couple of years ago. This is the car that I love so much. This is the car that made me proud. And this is the car that uh, proved that classic Mercedes. Uh, is the best car in the world. This is an amazing machine. It currently has a uh, I'm sure it has more than half a million miles on it right now and Just want to update you a little bit on about this car guys. So this car is not my car anymore However, uh, let me tell you a couple more things about this car. So this car is currently um, my friend is the owner of this car and he's actually he's really into classic uh, mercedes diesels and he's always wanted one of these cars so he is currently taking care of this amazing machine he has a lot of plans for this car and as you can see it currently has different wheels i gave him some different uh, tires and wheels the wheels are not in the best shape however the tires are in a pretty decent shape so he's gonna run those four right now uh, and uh, one of the things that the owner already did on this car is he replaced the ignition lock, uh, like steering lock assembly basically. So there was a problem with the old steering lock assembly, it literally jammed up. So he ordered brand new one, OEM brand new one, yes we found a brand new one. And he ordered that and replaced it. So right now everything is good with the key, everything is amazing, there's no issues with that. Now guys, uh, as you can see, and the car still looks pretty much the same on the outside uh, from where we left it. Uh, so as you remember, I replaced this fender right there. And then there's still we still have three good doors to put on this car. There's still a lot of work that we have to do to this car. But what I told him and I promised him that I will be helping out uh, with all the repairs and work on this car. And he's uh, mechanically inclined. He knows what he's doing. He's also going to be putting a lot of love to this car. He loves classic cars. And uh, he told me that he's going to get a new grill for it and a bunch of other things as well. So everything is coming guys. But this car is alive. It's all good. There's nothing wrong with this car. This car runs and drives amazingly. There's still a lot of things that we have to do guys to this car. However, it's such an amazing machine. I really love it so much. And I think a lot of you have missed this car, especially on my channel because I used to make a lot of videos about this car. But this car is super awesome. I'm super proud of this car. I love this car. And uh, <clears throat> I'm gonna keep saying that just because this car made me super proud, especially after I took this car. You guys cannot, re like, you won't imagine, uh, but if some of you, I know, like old followers and subscribers you guys know that I took this car two and a half years ago from Midwest to um, West Coast and this car made it amazingly no problems it's it's pretty amazing guys anyways guys so this car made me super proud because uh, it was in such a poor shape of course I did some uh, minor things to it before I took it on a trip across the country you know but I knew that there was a lot more things wrong with this car while I was taking it on this long of a road trip the CV axle boots were like uh, very cracked and there was a lot of other things and issues the brake lines were rusty and there was a lot of things wrong with this car but you guys will not believe this car made it amazingly like I, I think I drove like 2500 miles uh, that 
perfect time on this car and this car made me so proud and after I uh, took it to West Coast I started doing a lot more work on it I did a lot of mechanical work to it and a bunch of other things as well guys so I, I kept putting love to this amazing car uh, they all deserve it they're amazing um, and anyways but other than that guys my friend is currently taking care of this car this car is not mine anymore um, and he are, here are a couple of reasons why because I um, you know the life is crazy and I started getting a lot of cars coming my way and there's another W126 420 SEL that I'm currently taking care of uh, and there's another you know there's a lot of other cars and most of fixing customers cars and things like that so life is crazy guys so I just was I was looking for someone who will take a great care of this car and my friend he will take a great care of this car we already have three good used doors that we're gonna put on because as you can see these are all rusted unfortunately <laughs> this is all pretty bad stuff this is all rust right there horrible <laughs> um, and already installed the right front fender which is original and good condition rust free I'm not sure what I'm, what I'm gonna do about the left front um, fender is probably gonna get replaced because it's aftermarket and you know unfortunately I don't like it so we're probably gonna find a good used original fender for it just so you guys can see this is the part that my friend had to replace on this car it's original it's a steering lock right there uh, I'll show you in a second what happened to this one but there was an issue with this one so we replaced it all right there's a lot of other things that need to uh, to be done to this car we also have to detail it and wash it a little bit um, and other than that there's uh, this car slowly but surely I know it's it's a slow progress but this car is going to be getting uh, back to its shape uh, it's it's pretty awesome there's um, like th this car will not be left alone guys I promise to you so I know a lot of you were asking where's this car where's this car why it's not on the channel anymore so there you guys have it. now you guys know and like I said I started having a lot of other cars coming my way and everything it was just like overwhelming and crazy some people were telling me hey you you gotta get this car off of me because I'm gonna you know like throw it away or something you know and then I was like oh man uh, so anyways that's kind of the story but this car is in good hands guys this car is amazing this car is still gonna be represented Sending Vito's garage the sticker is still there and I'm, I'm also here I'm gonna be uh, helping my friend out with the restoration of this car we still have to actually replace the timing chain of this car it's one of the tasks we have to do but I've been just so busy and everything but anyways as you guys remember also replace the uh, you know exhaust system on this car so it has a really good exhaust the old one was just rotted out it was pretty bad um, so don't forget to give all your classic cars, all the love, guys. Uh, they're amazing. Uh, they didn't make them like they used to. And other than that, I'm about to show you under the hood. There hasn't been uh, many changes, but I just wanted to show you guys just so you guys can see uh, what is up. Also, guys, the interior, as you can see, it's like slightly taken apart. That side still needs to be uh, welded, the floors. Uh, that's gonna come soon. This side is all good. There's no problems with this side. Uh, with my friend took this door panel out because there was an issue with the locks but however this door will be getting changed anyway so he took out the panel but that's fine he will just have to swap all the motors and everything to the other door but everything else that's what it looks like all right the seats and everything uh, 446,000 miles on it right now um, everything else is intact pretty much I mean like all the floor mats and everything uh, the door panels are still all good and uh, yeah it's awesome guys center console uh, just needs a little bit more love guys alright so that's what this car is going to be getting but it's super reliable super amazing car they literally they don't make them like they used to this is a tank a real German tank alright my friends there's the under the hood as you can see there's not many changes over here there's going to be to be soon uh, but just not at the moment however everything is amazing with the engine all amazing reliable uh, great I put a lot of love to this engine before I gave it uh, to my friend um, yeah so he's pretty happy with the car everything is great everything is awesome I'm about to start it up guys just so you guys can hear this amazing OM 617 turbo 
great machine uh, super awesome and I think in the future what we're gonna need we're gonna he's gonna replace the uh, turn signal lenses because he's gonna repaint this bumper right here refresh it and we're gonna get a different grill for sure because this grill is uh, as you can see after Morgan it's all rusted and uh, you know I tried restoring it but unfortunately there's it's pretty hard um, the rust is still coming back uh, However, I was able to remove the rust with the rust dissolver, but again, it's just temporary. Uh, and yeah, he's going to get a new grill and everything for this car. Um, and that's how everything is with that. So this is the old uh, steering lock right here. And what happened to it is actually, I mean, everything was working fine, but then eventually what happened to it is behind this part, there's actually a metal uh, kind of like almost looking like this part and then it just like sheared off it's a pretty common issue on a classic mercedes especially this one so my friend just got a brand new one and he replaced it everything is amazing now no more problems this car is such a champ guys so beautiful so amazing it's going to be getting repaired and restored slowly but surely all right guys everything is amazing everything is great the car is in great hands the car has a good home that's the most important thing and i'm also here so the car is not going anywhere i'm gonna be helping my friend out with this car he's happy with this car he's also like he has another daily driver but he also drives this uh, car quite a while but he's gonna be driving a lot more after we replace the timing chain which will come in the future however everything is awesome about this car everything is great so thank you for all of you who were concerned uh, everything is great with this amazing car um, it's just uh, my friend really wanted the diesel Mercedes and I was like alright I have this one maybe you'll be interested and you know, I still need some work here and there but I've done so much work to this car guys and yeah there you guys have it. my friend owns this car right now guys don't forget to like this video subscribe to my channel there's a lot of classic car content that I post on this channel everything is great and don't forget to take care of your classic cars that I make them like they used to and before I end this video I'm gonna start it up for you guys and then we'll just uh, you know gonna end this video soon um, and you know I just want to make you an update video about this car just so you guys are aware uh, that this car is my friend's car right now and he's super happy with it and he's gonna be putting all of the love into this car amazing car guys so literally super awesome super comfortable super reliable like I have no words guys but uh, everything is great starts right up I mean it's what else do you want from such an amazing car so yeah just needs a couple more things some love and that's it guys it's gonna be great it's gonna be such a great car um literally lovely machine everything works on this car i mean literally there's uh, yeah, seriously like they don't make them like they used to guys that's why you got to take care of these amazing cars or just send them to me so they just take them off your hands probably <laughs> but uh, anyways long story short guys like i said my friend will be uh, it also has power windows whoever didn't know and i did a lot of lubrication maintenance on it and everything is great but uh like I said guys, this, uh, this car still needs quite a bit of work and we'll be working on this car. This is a legendary car, um, you know, this is a historic car, especially for myself because uh, I've, been, uh, I've been through a lot with this car and I really appreciate this car because um, there's nothing else better than this car. Uh, it's super reliable. I had a, an amazing time with this car while I, was, while I owned it for two years. Did a lot of work to it, did, put a lot of... Uh, time and effort to this car and super great car um, Tons of work has been done still needs tons of work, but as soon as this car is done It's gonna be such an amazing machine All right guys, we're gonna go drive it a little bit um, Not a little bit just uh, you know, I'm not gonna it's not gonna be a test drive or anything I'm just gonna show you how it is how this car is but it feels great it feels amazing I'm like a king uh, it's got this huge steering wheel guys and it's just a super fun car honestly saying super reliable uh, great cruiser um, yeah still needs some work but guys this is a 40 year old car it's pretty insane um, and super fun lovely car 
uh, square bodies for life, uh, like they're saying. But uh, yeah, I'm super proud of this car. Um, yeah, so anyway, so I just wanted to thank you for all of you uh, for watching this video, supporting my channel and everything, guys. It means a lot. Thank you so much for all your time stopping by, hitting the likes and comments, writing your comments. It really means a lot. Thank you for all your support, guys.